Hey, what's up? Nice to have you back. Today we're talking about something very interesting. Does diet lemonade make me fat? Is stevia a healthy alternative to sugar? And what exactly is aspartame? That are my topics for today's episode. My name is Sasha. Let's go. Diet lemonade makes you thin. What is the damn deal? Some people claim that consuming those products makes them thinner. No. You must be joking or you're just wrong. Nutritional researchers of the University of San Antonio in Texas conducted a study on the ratio between consuming diet lemonades and the growth of senior citizens' bellies. The conclusion? It grew bigger on subjects which consumed diet lemonade than on the control group who didn't. Intense consumption increased the belly circumference even more. Let's talk numbers. Those with daily consumption gained an average of 8 centimeters. Occasional drinkers gained 3 centimeters and the control group which didn't have any diet lemonade gained 2. Unfortunately, the researchers can't explain why. They assume that on one hand, drinking diet lemonade could have fooled the consumer on thinking he can now eat more. And on the other hand, that the lemonade itself could be the cause. For now, let us record the fact. Diet lemonade makes you thicker. Stevia, a healthy alternative to sugar? In our minds these days, sugar is considered to be a deadly poison. Not surprising that the food industry is pretty happy about consumers who want to pay more money for products that contain less sugar. Because high amounts of sugar support illnesses caused by civilization. True! 25 grams of sugar for women and 30 grams of sugar for men. That's a recommendation of the WHO. Sadly, half a liter of Coke with stevia already contains 34 grams. In general, research studies on stevia came to very different conclusions. In unrealistic high amounts, it lowers the blood pressure but supports cancer. Great! In realistic low amounts, on the other hand, it can protect you from cancer. What? Nice to know, stevia has zero calories and therefore no effect on your insulin level. Let's summarize. Some objective opinions in favor of stevia had been made. <laughs> but, and I mean this, the stevia extract that we consume has not much to do with the original stevia plant. It's most certainly low to not even natural at all. So don't be fooled by the advertising of natural. Yes, but the extract we mostly consume isn't. Aspartame, the devil of all sweeteners? Let's give you a piece of my mind. Aspartame, which will be found in light and zero products, supports cancer. Although this was only shown on animals which received an unrealistic high dose of that substance. To put you under the same risk, you would have to drink 30 liters of diet lemonade. Ah, believe me, cancer would be one of your slightest problems. Some other study from last year conducted that synthetic sweeteners such as aspartame could harm the intestinal flora. So is it the devil? Yeah, in some ways, but it's not as devilish as often stated. That's it on aspartame. Maybe you wonder about fructose and its individual role in this talk. Juices and fruits, those are super awesome, right? No. Fructose is processed to fat in your liver. It cannot be activated as energy right away, unlike glucose. Studies show that your plasma lipid concentration will rise. This goes hand in hand with a higher risk of fatty degeneration of the liver and diabetes. So should I quit eating fruits? No. Again, these symptoms are only apparent if you consume very high amounts of fructose. My advice. Coke, Coke Light, Coke Zero, other diet lemonades, cocaine. No. Enjoy responsibly. Rather have a glass of regular Coke. A normal one. 
not this. If your reason for drinking diet lemonades is weight loss, you are just straight up conducting nonsense. By the way, you can reduce your insulin reaction by eating something sugar-free and fat-free along with your Coke. The best tip I can give you though is to drink regular water. If you're interested, click right here. There are some tips and guidelines on how much you need to drink during a day. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like. I'm excited for next week. This was Satisfaction with the Nutri Guide. My name is Sasha. Your body is your body. Bye bye.